Okay, MP Cooper is digging into basically why people didn't recuse themselves and uh, the donations. There's a lot to this. There'll be more uh, definitely coming out. And, and I would stay close to your newspapers because there's a lot of information that needs to be digested by you know, journalists and everything. So here, check this out. A little more natural. I know that Miss Lynn and Pascal Fournier were trying to rebuild history by seeing, by looking at past files and examining exchanges in emails regarding that donation and with people who were no longer employed at the foundation. They examined the communications and I was informed as VP that there had been messages or emails stating that there had been directives coming from a Chinese entity that was more or less telling them who receipts needed to be made out to regarding that donation. We have about 30 seconds left. Um, would you say that the uh, testimony of uh, Ms. Lynn would be valuable if this committee were able to, to take it? Just a yes or no, if you could, please. We. Oui. Thank Je you very much. Oui. Yes, I believe so. Um, over uh, several times, over multiple meetings, it was decided that uh, Mr. Johnson, Salas, and McNiven should recuse themselves because they were in a conflict of interest. Is that correct? Yes. Um, and did they recuse themselves? No. And uh, why Mr. wouldn't they recuse themselves? Mr. Mr. Barrett? Uh, Faudrait uh, leur demander. You'd have to ask them. Okay, thank you. Members, you heard it here first.